this is Danielle, your Texan treasure hunter here to show you our great blue moon sale that we have this weekend. We are in the Northgate area, which is close to Champions, and the sale is going to be Friday and Saturday from April 5th and 6th from 9 to 2 both days. This is a great house. This is our super eclectic art house with tons of jewelry and really cool art and unique pieces of furniture that you never find anywhere else. So step inside with me and let's see what we have. Okay, so we've stepped inside the main house. You'll see right when you come in, there's kind of this uh, middle dining area. This table is actually not for sale, so we're blocking this off for people not to go up there. We do have this beautiful trunk though. If you can see, it's metal with leather and wood accents. This is a really nice, neat original piece of art here. And then on the wall, we have these antique windows that make for really cool decorations. And then I'm gonna head to my left to the main living room and wanna point out this house has a lot of levels. So be careful stepping down. This is kind of the main sitting area. We have this beautiful L-shaped couch. It's a dark gray color. And then this chair, this is a Paul Robert Roberts chair, and it swivels and turns. It's in really great shape, and I love the curvy on the front and just the curve on the sides. It's a really neat chair. Nice accent piece. You'll see there's lots of unique pieces in this house. This is not your normal furnished house. Everything in here is so artistic and some is eclectic and it's just very unique items like this coffee table, for example. So if you can see, it is a door. It's a metal door. I believe she said it came from a church. It's an antique piece and then the glass was cut to fit specifically on top because you can see even the cutout for the, the handle, the lock of the door. And then it's got these really awesome stones holding it up. This is just a gorgeous table and what a conversation piece and a centerpiece, you know, for your area, beautiful. Some nice rugs in here. There is tons of jewelry. And so this is where our jewelry is going to be is all by the register here. So I'm gonna walk you around a little bit. Lift the case for the glare. So there is some Betsy Johnson. There's some Whitney Davis. There's some Coach, some Chanel. There's some really vintage pieces. Super unique items, juicy. So that's in one box. This is another box where we have lots of silver and gold pieces and then tons of pins. Look at, these little pins are so pretty. dogs and zebras and alligators and owls and birds and just all kinds of cool vintage and antique pieces. Tons of rings. Look at these rings. Beautiful perfume bottles, ring holder. And then this piece is cool. It's a bracelet. And then it attaches and it has the ring down below. It's more juicy, some little vintage glasses. And then even in these little bags, there's so many unique pieces in here. I mean, look at that. So cool, those sunglasses, all kinds of neat pieces to flip through in here. Over here, here's where our checkout register will be, and then over here is even more jewelry. So we've got tons of beautiful necklaces, 
fish. This fish too. I mean, so many neat pieces. Look at this one. I love that one. Lots of bracelets. That one with the matador on it. Hello Kitty. And here's even more pieces. Look at this with the little camels. This is gorgeous. Wow, that is a statement piece right there. Just tons and tons of jewelry at this house and such unique items. We have this recliner here that is John Elway. It's from Bassett. This is actually one of two in the house. Really nice piece. And then we have this beautiful armoire. Again, just super unique pieces of furniture in this house. Okay, so as we step to the other side of the house, this is one of the bedrooms. I do want to point out for people to be careful because there is a lot of stairs up and down in this house, a lot of sunken uh, rooms. So just do be careful with that. So again, just more unique furniture pieces as you're going to see in here. This little bookshelf and some jewelry boxes. This is a beautiful dresser the mirror on top, and look at the drawer pulls, the crystal knobs, gorgeous. This really rustic bookcase, the trunk. Inside the trunk, there's some antique and vintage clothing in here. This is a really nice bookshelf. It's bigger on the bottom and then it tapers to the top. It's really unique. I keep saying that, but everything in this house is so different, different than what you see in most houses, which makes this house so special. This is a beautiful jewelry box. Many, many jewelry boxes. Look at this one with all the jewels on top of it. figurines, Chotsky's more custom pottery. We have this little rustic cabinet here. Again, little small cabinet. A room divider screen. This is a neat piece too. And again, look at the, the poles with the beautiful crystal knob. And then in this room, we have a leather recliner. This one matches the one in the other room. So they're a set actually. Some purses. pair of pillars. These are really cool architectural pieces, a bunch of frames and all kinds of unique little knickknacks. You just gotta look everywhere in this house because there's such a variety of things. Okay, let's head over to the bathroom where we have some of the clothing and some fashion items. A few makeup 
sets, curling iron, this kimono is beautiful and it's an authentic kimono. Really pretty. Some nice jackets, London Fog, Columbia, Calvin Klein. Throw pillows. And then in here in the closet, we have a few clothing items, some shoes, some hats, and then some more linens, sheets and towels and little quilts and vintage doilies and et cetera, et cetera. Okay, so I'm heading into the kitchen and I just wanted to show you this antique door. This is actually a chicken door. So the, for a chicken coop, so the top and the bottom, they close up and then you can open it for ventilation. And look at those old keys, those are cool. Okay, so let's go into the kitchen. Uh, I guess the pantry first or the utility room first. We have this carpet steamer. And then just normal kind of utility room things. A washer and dryer not for sale. Let's go around the countertops in the kitchen. Again, a lot of unique pieces in here. Pottery. Bowls, very unique items. This is one you guys will recognize. This vintage Pyrex set and actually, actually all four pieces of the Pyrex bowls. It's rare to have all four. So I'm sure those of you that collect it know. Lots of little interesting dishes and serveware. There's some restaurant wear. And then some glasses, beautiful red rim glasses. More restaurant wear. Starbucks mug, I think that's a big Pampered Chef piece. Over here, more of this original custom pottery. Look at that Minnesota cutting board, that's cool. I have family that lives in Minnesota, they would love that. Some pots and pans. And over here in the cabinet, there's some small appliances, a Cuisinart air fryer, magic bullet, and some bakeware. This little room off to the side, we've got this cute little velvet chair with the gold legs. Surround yourself with tacos, love it little bookcase, that little bare redwood sculpture, that's from Redwood, so that's interesting. More artwork. This little secretary desk, antique secretary. Again, it looks like the knob has been upgraded. And then look at all the Little compartments, cute little desk. Some bar stools and craft supplies. More art. This is actually on a painted on a window. This is cool. And then lots of different pictures and some crocs and stoneware. Okay, so now I've come upstairs, up the main stairs, and we have this built-in bookcase with tons of unique and different books, just like all the artwork in this house. Some of the books are really cool too. So you can see we have this men's dress catalog. We've got lots of 
different, just all kinds of different books. Many old books, vintage and antique books. We've got some games. We've got some vintage catalogs down here. Some people still collect those. More games. These are some beautiful coffee table books. Here in the window, we have these glass orbs. We actually had these a couple weeks ago at another house and they're just beautiful. They're a little bit backlit here. I'm trying to get, there we go. Again, more vintage books. And then we have this Kirby vacuum. I'm going to turn around and go into the media room and as I do you see we have a couple of Christmas trees here in the boxes and then we're going to go in here to the media room, movie room. So we have this leather sectional with ottoman. It's a couple piece of ottoman so you can move it around and have it how you like it and then a nice recliner. Behind me is the entertainment center. A little small TV, and then there's a larger TV over here that was already removed from the wall, but it is for sale as well. This is a beautiful vintage buffet. Look at the lines on this. The scallops. Really nice, unique piece. So many unique pieces of furniture and collectibles in this house. You can see all the little vintage pieces. There's some more restaurant wear up here. The shelf that they're on is not for sale, but all the pieces are for sale. Another unique cabinet. Here's some more custom pottery. Lots of custom pottery in this house. We go over here to the bedroom. This is where we have a lot of our holiday items, but there's also some vintage clothing and nice clothing. Look at this vintage wedding dress. It's just gorgeous. Some Christmas items. Nice big flocked Christmas tree and then some ornaments. In the closet here, we have some fashion items. Look at some of these evening gowns. This one's beautiful with the beads. And then here in the closet, there's lots of linens and tablecloths, comforter, some jackets and some fashion items. Some more quilts and things up top. And then more Christmas on this side. Okay, this little bedroom has a couple things in it. This couch is not for sale, but this bed is over here, a little twin platform bed. And then we have this antique vanity, also for sale, a stool. This small corner armoire cabinet. Some shoes, accessories, mirror. That's a cool piece with the moon up there. And then we have this Duraflame little heater, space heater. And the last room we have upstairs, this was an art studio, so there's a lot of art supplies and art in here. The, act, the rug on the floor is not for sale, but everything else in here is. So we have this antique folding art table. You can see the sides, drop leaf, and then the drawers in the middle. Again, more unique pieces, some art supplies. And then on the wall, we have some art. Everything is original, very eclectic and different. 
more coffee table books. This table here is actually a military uh, dressing table. You can see the buckle underneath, it folds up. So it's kind of a cool piece. We're here in the window. These are wood and then they have a clay top. They're like carved, so they're three dimensional. So these are pretty cool art pieces. Large, big art easel. Paints and art supplies. Over here, there's a bunch of prints. Again, original prints in here that are beautiful. And then lots of art supplies over here. Plus some more custom original pottery. So these are pretty, they're all unique and different. Little cabinet. Okay, so that's everything upstairs. We'll go back down. Over here in the bar area, right before we go outside, you'll see several beautiful crystal pieces. This is really pretty decanter. Some serving dishes. A couple more decanters. Let's head outside. Okay, so as we step outside, we have things outside here on the patio that are for sale, but anything beyond the patio with the exception of one thing on the fence is not for sale. So I'm just gonna kind of walk you around a little bit. Lots of cool little yard figurines. We've brought them all in here, so they're easy to get. Look at this guy, I love him. Little folding drink cart. Wind chimes, they're for sale. They sound so pretty up here. And then you see this art on the fence over here is for sale. It's just so big we left it on the fence. There is an umbrella with umbrella stand and some pots. This is a really pretty pot down here. Two hose reels and this little storage cabinet. More little yard characters. Okay, so now we've come out to the garage. This is the last room, and we have again some unique antique cool doors and windows and stuff out here. And then your typical garage stuff that you know you would expect to find. There's a couple neat tables, lots of garagey type supplies, including this very Nice ladder, some more garage, lots of hardware, bolts, screws, some hammers, decorative boxes. This is a nice little work table, this metal work table here. Some dog pet supplies. This is a folding uh, easy up canopy, lawnmower, and then a couple tools over here. This delta saw and cutter. And then the actual shelf is also for sale, the wood shelf. So again, our sale is going to be Friday and Saturday, April 5th and 6th from nine to two both days. We are in the Northgate area in, this is actually a Houston address, but really close to spring, close to the Champions area. No appointments needed for this sale. We'll see you this weekend.